Now, if you're looking for a great streaming application, giving you access to lots of live TV channels with a fully working program guide, all presented in a really nice interface, which works great on your Fire Stick, on your Android TV devices. The application also has a large free video on demand section, lots of movies, lots of TV shows. Now all of this content is available without any kind of registration, no usernames, no passwords. And with this latest update, they really have bundled so much more free content. So please do take a moment to hit that like button, make sure you hit that subscribe button. So with all of that being said, let's get started. If you're new to the channel and you want to stay up to date with the latest tech tutorials, the latest Fire Stick, Android and Android TV tips and tricks, then please do subscribe and hit the notification bell. It's a small click from you, but it makes a big difference to me. Thank you. And let's now start the application for the first time. Now, as I mentioned before, the application has a really nice clean interface. We have the main menu on the left, starting with a search. So you can search across those movies, TV shows, and even channels. This is the home section that we're on at the moment. Then you have the free on demand section, free live TV. Then you have collections. And you can just see guys, they really do have lots of great content all broken down into different genres that you can access from here. Then you have my library, but this does require you to sign in. And for this demonstration, I'm gonna show you what's available without any kind of login or registration. And let's go into settings. Here we can just see that this is the latest version, which as of April, 2022 is version 3.36.0. Let's go to the home. Okay, now as this is an official application, they also support renting. So if you do want to rent the latest movies, you can do all of that directly from the application. Let's keep going down. So here's the trending now section. And here we can see some of the new things I've added with this latest release. So here we can see we just have binge-worthy live TV. So lots of different channels. Here we can see cops, law and crime, uh, the price is right, lots of different things. And here we can see some uh, baseball. Uh, let's try this uh, America's Test Kitchen. Click on that. Give that a second. And we can see that's working straight away. Superb HD picture. I can press the select button. We can see some information about what we're watching. I can enable the subtitles. Click on that. And we can see them at the top there. So really easy to use. And that's the key thing about these official applications is because they're official, normally you get HD quality content without any kind of buffering or lag. So lots of different channels in here. I'll just click on see more. And now we're presented with this beautiful looking program guide where we can see exactly what's on, what's coming on next. Here we can see the list of channels or I can go to the left and we can now see the different categories. So if I'm only interested in news and weather, I can go to that first, move to the right, and then I'll see the news and weather channels only. So let's try this uh, Boston 25, click on that. Just to show you that it's not just a couple of channels or a couple of things, everything I'm clicking on in this section is working, it's working straight away and working absolutely fine. And we can see the subtitles are still on. And let's just turn this off actually. So let's turn this off. Okay, that's now off. Let's press back. So you've got sections for action and sci-fi, movies, sports. So lots of different things in the sports section as well, including bean sports, um, some other stuff that I don't want to name. Uh, if you keep going down, then now we're in the food and uh, design section. So again, lots of different channels in here. Then you have comedy. Then you've got classic TV and movies, kids and family music, travel and lifestyle, local news, lots of different channels in the local news. So if you're interested in that, then you've got a section for uh, Spanish content. Let's go back. Then the free on demand section is where you see lots of different movies, uh, leaving soon section. Now all of these are ad supported, which means before the content starts, you will see an advert. Now, for some reason during my testing, anything I clicked on in here, which you can see, you get to see a summary of what you're about to watch. You can see it does say here, watch free with ads. Let's click on that. But for some reason, when I tested this, 
nothing would actually play in the video on demand section so i'm not sure if there's an issue on their side at the moment maybe there's some maintenance work or they're updating something or maybe it's the fact that my ip address is something that they're not happy with but uh, do leave me a comment below guys and let me know that if you try this especially if you're not using any kind of vpn are you able to watch the free video on demand section and if any of you guys are still here with me then if you drop a like on this video and leave the comment hashtag red then i know you made it this far in the video which i always appreciate i'll then heart your comment let's go to the search if i'm searching for cooking click on next this now finds all of the content in there and the great thing is we can now filter those results and say i'm only interested in the free content so click on that and we now see these three things are available completely free that we can watch on this application so overall guys i think it's a fantastic application especially with that latest update they really have added in lots more live tv content especially on the home screen where you can see different channels different genres and all of that you can enjoy without any registration and for most of you in usa you don't need to use any kind of vpn to access this content so let me now show you how you can install this version on all of your devices now on the amazon devices the first thing you need to do is go over to your settings go over to my fi tv where it says developer options let's click on that where it says install unknown apps click on that find download in the list and just make sure that's set to on and this just means that we can download applications through downloader once you've confirmed that let's now open up downloader we can now make a quick connection to my website which is just techdoctoruk.com or you can type in this short code 53402 let's type that in click on go or you can press the play button on your remote now when you get to my site head over to the hamburger menu which is one with the three lines let's click on that click on tutorials and the latest tutorial in the list will be how we can get this updated version of the Redbox application. Let's open that up. Here we are. So we can see this is the latest update for April 2022. Let's scroll down. And underneath all of that, we'll see the latest version of this application. In fact, I think I've left the previous versions on here. So we can see the previous one or the first one that I shared was from October. Then we had one from January. And this is the latest one from April. And as you know, this application is designed for the USA audience. So make sure you are in USA or you have a USA IP address um, or you can click here. Okay, so on the latest version, so I'm gonna click on this one here, scroll down and click on this green download button. And this will then install the latest version on our device. That's all for this video, guys. Many thanks for watching. I know you guys are always looking for more applications, more streaming applications, more legal streaming applications. And I do think this application with the latest update is definitely worthwhile checking out. So please do subscribe, hit the notification bell with all notifications, and I'll hopefully catch up with you guys real soon. Thanks.